what's going on ladies and gentlemen this is demo storm and we're here on my arc server on the aca mod you guys seem to enjoy it so we're going to continue this series on top of the pvp series i'm just waiting for some people to get on so i thought i would do an episode on the aca mod as always the server is free to join this month so come online come enjoy it with me some people already have a freaking brood mother for god's sakes they've been playing all day so i was thinking today i'm going to try and passively tame this stego that showed up here uh no idea if i can but might as well try you know, is not hungry yet. So he'll eat berries just by me hand feeding him. It is a 15 times server. So hopefully I'll be able to gather enough berries to tame this little bastard. And he's a female adolescent. So I'll have to like raise him before I can really do anything. But that's pretty cool to me. I enjoy that factor here. Gotta be careful I don't walk into that turkey over there. But I feel like this would be a good time to get some type of mount. Let's put uh, blueberries here. Gonna lose some taming efficiency. Not a big deal. Especially at an adolescent age. Not gonna bother me the slightest. I'm gonna need more berries. But it, it should be simple as that. Um... I like the idea of having passive teams on all dinosaurs. It just it gives you another aspect of things. I mean, I could knock it out and, you know, do it that way. I believe there's another thing on this mod that allows me to insta-hunger it. Or make it insta-starve, so that should be fun. But I thought I would get a mount just for overall base defense. I mean, this one's going to have to be grown, it looks like. Parasaur. I have seen these parasaurs attack, but they're a different color when they attack people. Let's hope, turkey. Yo, bro. We're cool. We're cool. I have 14 purple berries. Might as well run with the purple ones until I run out. And I know it's not the most interesting thing, or people will think it's a little overpowered, but... You know. This ge this is all about having fun and doing, you know, these cool teams that are around the map. You know, we got dinosaurs everywhere. Let me just pick this all up. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need kibble fast in this game as well. Might switch to yellow berries. Depending on, like, how many berries I have in my inventory, I might be able to just spam E. Amar berries seem to be very popular over here. Oh, yeah. No, my God. Actually, let's do red berries for now. And I'll switch it out for yellow. But, yeah. Just a quick little taming thing. I mean... Never hurts to have more dinosaurs. And I haven't tamed a Stego in forever. I like his colors. The red spine going on there. But just showing you guys some of the things that are possible in the game. By, you know, passive dinosaur taming on most dinosaurs. So, you know, take that for granted. Instead of having to chase everything down and knock it out. I mean, I could probably knock this guy out pretty easily. And then I have to, you know, do the whole keep it asleep and stuff thing. That's not exactly the best choice. Uh, yeah, not a best choice. And he gets hungry quick, which is nice. I'm gonna spam tap E. So if you hear me spam tapping, that's just me tapping away. Come on, buddy. Not the worst thing in the world. Do purple berries go faster? I believe they do. Does it have a favorite food? I don't remember. We'll just waste all the purple berries we have first. And his taming shouldn't go down, so I should be able to pick more purple berries. That seems like a better idea. Instead of wasting all 91 levels. I mean, high-level dinosaurs will matter in this mod. I mean, 606, there's level 660s on the map, so take that for granted. You know, I'm reading my Discord right now. Someone tamed a 376 Shrike, Mr. Ghostly Howl. And he's only been on today. So, if you want to just enjoy a nice PvE experience, try out the mod. Remember to check that link in the description. I will say, do you want to play on the server? And then just click that. Or join the Discord. That's the best way to do it. If you have issues, I can help you out. I walked probably 9 or 10 people through the whole system today. Of how to, like, set it all up and get yourself on quickly. That is a person. But, you know, it happens. 
right now, I believe we hit 15 people today. And if the server does fill up, Mr. Uh, Mr. Matt at Netrato said he would up the server limit. So you guys have nothing to worry about, you know, with the server filling up or something. And I am still running only 21 ping. With people building all over the map now and dinosaurs being tamed everywhere. Not bad at all. And I mean, ping has nothing to do with server lag. And I have no server lag. This is the smoothest I've ever played this game. So if you guys want to rent a server, remember to check out the Netrato link down below. That is, you know, you have to pay for that, obviously. But if you want to just enjoy it with your buddies and mod it however you want, or run your own server, or say you have a YouTube channel and you want to have your own server, look at that link. Click that link. Just check it out. You don't have to buy right away. You can just check it out, see your prices, you know, check everything out. But I'll tell you, uh, these guys are actually the hosts of most of the official servers that you see. And when you click that big button up in the right-hand corner when looking at the server log, like rent your own EU server or whatever, that's them. And they're just, they're finally branching into the U.S. market and stuff like that. So check it out. Uh, I can tell you it's probably one of the best servers I've been on. So I'm not going to say that just as an affiliate. I'm not only saying that. It is one of the smoothest gameplays. And that comes from just people on my mod team and stuff like that. And I've played on quite a few servers, I'll tell you that right now. Like, not even just ones I've YouTube done. So come check it out. Runs like a dream. And look, and that whole spiel right there, you know, we almost tamed a stego. Come on. You're only adolescent, so you still gotta grow up big and strong. But, you know, we have a new pet. And he is mine. He is my dog. And movement speed. Level 17. Moving up on, you know, the world. Here, eat these berries. I love this, though. I love being able to passively tame this dinosaur instead of having to waste all my tranks. I'm going to waste my tranks on carnivores, obviously. I want a raptor. Move around the map. You know, find new places. The farther inland you go, the more of these crazy dinosaurs you see, like, you'll see elemental versions of these guys. Ooh, ran out of berries. Blueberries it is. I believe Trikes actually like the Azul Berries for speed, but not for uh, taming efficiency. So I don't know what about Stegos. Or that's how it used to be back in the day. You know, but everyone just goes Purple Berries because taming efficiency and stuff's like that. Come on, Mr. Stego. I love hand-feeding a Stego. Look at how adorable. I have not tamed a Stego in seasons, I'll tell you. Seasons and seasons and seasons. Just mash E. I mean, it could seem easy. If you're in difficulty, you're looking for difficulty, believe me, it gets there. If you want to go and fight, the, you know, evolve your dinosaurs. So I found out you can, like, harvest DNA off of dinosaurs and you evolve your dinosaurs. Some types can be evolved, which is pretty bomb. Like, <laughs> when they said the word evolve, I was like, what? All right, guys. So you guys get to name it. Uh, we're just going to transfer these berries over. And you're going to come with me, sir. Come on, buddy. No, you stupid dodo. I can't hand feed you. Adolescent stego, just like that. There we go. Boom. Oh, no. Turkey. All right. We got fiber. It's time to learn some clothes. We're a little naked. Get some clothes on, at least. So we don't freeze. Boom. Boom. Let's do it. Boom. Like that. Make seven more of these arrows. Alright, we're going to take this for now. Ooh, that was bad. That was a bad idea. There. That's all I wanted. That way. We can do this. Boom shakalaka. Alright, we gotta cook some food up. Get inside while it's still 
relatively cold. I brought some wood inside. Boom. 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 Keep ourselves warm so our food doesn't go down rapidly. Then we're going to go try and tame something today. Hopefully not die. It happens, though. Turkey, go away. Go fuck yourself, Mr. Turkey. Pelagornis. Debating if I should kill that or hold my arrows. I'm probably going to hold my arrows. Oh, someone tamed a trike. I was so confused. I'm like, that trike was not there earlier. <gasps> oh, man. That was, that was something. That was almost awful. The demon turkeys. Demon turkeys. I'll tell you. Fill some of that food up for now. And let's take a quick look around the map. Uh, that stego will probably have to be fed before I get off the server, but by the time we get on tomorrow, it should be raised. Or at least close to adulthood. And that was somebody's brood mother. As you can see, thing is nutty. Go out hunting real fast. See if we can find something cool to tame. Like a patchy? Corporate patchy? What type of patchy are you? Power patchy. I have no idea what it takes to tame you guys. Real fast, let's take a look at our engrams. Grappling hooks. Easter egg. Not really high enough to touch this stuff yet. Not bad, though. Not bad. Wow, I'm already hungry. Oh, no. The cold. Oh, no. The cold. Yeah, I don't think I'm ready to tame exactly Apache like that. But with time, we'll figure it out. All right, it's now not freezing cold outside anymore. I want to find one of these crazy dinosaurs I can tame. Baby turtle over there. Some stegalugalugals. Hundred ninety four harvest strike. Power monkey. Let me see something real fast. Oh no, I flipped out the monkey. I probably could have tamed that too. That's the worst part about that whole thing. Beaver dam. I'm going to take that. Not going to lie. Alright, let's test these arrows. Alright. Probably a bad idea. Probably a really bad idea. Probably a... Terrible, terrible idea. High level compy. But I feel like a, a harvest strike might be powerful as hell for us. Oh no, wasted an arrow. I have no idea how many arrows I should have. But that wasn't enough. Definitely was not enough. Oop. 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 No, no, no. Just go away. Just go away. Just go away. Mistakes were made. Oh, God. Alright. Mistakes were made. I understand that now. 
Um, why can't we be friends? All right. We're now best friends. Right? We're not killing each other. Do I have the ability to feed you? I do not. I probably fucked that up. Not a big deal. Can I feed you? I can. But I can't feed you because you're special. Alright. So we're going to have to craft a bunch of those arrows at a later date. So this types you can't tame with stuff. Mondy teapot. Outside. Nice place to sleep, buddy. Big brood mothers jumping through the sky and stuff being tamed. Crazy. Let's try. Oh no, I fucked it up. Damn it. Probably should have grabbed some food. Not a big deal. Yeah, he's flipping out. So we're going to have to build a bunch of narco berries. And then... I don't know. Probably should just go straight onto a regular trike. Yeah, I'm thinking regular trike might be better. I can't passively tame you, correct? I cannot. I'm not high enough level yet. Maybe with some levels, I'll be able to passively tame some of the stuff. How are we on narco berries? Yeah, we need quite a few narco berries. What is it like to tame a level 41 trike? Ooh, this might be worth it, guys. Might be worth it as hell. 41 trike, not a big deal. I know levels do matter on these guys, but he's just honestly going to be a, uh, whatchamacallit, a, whatchamacallit collector. A narco berry collector for our early game. Where did my cursor go? Alright. So, Trike Saddle is coming up at level 20. We're going to bring him home and do some, you know, changes to our base. Ooh, I do have to learn Storage Bin. I got one given to me earlier. Due to me having to do some stuff around the server. Some glitches happened earlier. I'll oh, fix now. Is he running? Okay. And supposedly that guy's boon mother just died. <laughs> Fighting something. That's kind of scary to me. I'm just reading Discord to you guys just because I find it enjoyable that this stuff is just happening as we're all talking in this video. Look at that. This guy's going to grow up big and strong, big and strong. Here, take all the berries you need, buddy. Alright, my trike is home. We're gonna grab some food. And do a little bit of leveling off of building stuff. Let's see. ACA mod. At the ACA bench. Bench. ACA. ACA bench. I can't learn it yet. I'm not high enough level. Okay. That makes sense. We're going to store our cementing paste. Coming useful later. Also those. Craft as many trank arrows as we can. That way we are ready. And what can we add onto this house? So we need one of these. That and that. 
Huh. Icky saddle. I feel like spikes might come important. Raptly important later on. Feeding trough might be nice. Oh, the feeding trough. Basic metal wood. I'm going to try and collect some metal. The other stuff will come with. And then flint, obviously, will be helpful for arrow production. But I'd like to have a feeding trough. Hit this up. Hmm. I love how it'll always give me random metal when I don't need it, and when I do. Rebuild some stand. Lay down. There we go. How much metal do I have stored? Two. I need eight. Okay, feeding trough is out of the picture right now. Hide. I can do that. Boom. 52 arrows. Perfect. Help us get some levels. Put it in movement speed. I feel like it's going to be needed. Some quick arrow production right there. Not bad at all. Let's see. Uh, wood railing. I could build a raft. But that's a lot of hide. Kind of wasted. Here, we'll work on our dinosaur gate. Wood, stone, and thatch. Of course, I'm going to build a pen to store my dinosaurs in. Probably build it quite large, just so I can store many dinosaurs in it in the early game. How are we on the wood production? 280. Oh no. Not even close yet. Not even close yet. I want to get a saddle on this strike. Alright, we're just going to build the gate door now. Can't really carry the stuff. Just want those levels. You know what else I could build? Wood fence foundations. Those give you some good EXP early game. Early game EXPs. The next time we, you know, we come back online for another video, we should be able to do that quite fine. You're going to get some health, because everything around here wants to kill us. Is it like, do you want to die edition? Yes. No. But I feel like after this, we're going to go on a tame -thon. I think that's my next step. Because we'll have berries, and I can take down herbivores easily. Getting some narco berries and fibers. Going to need it all. Craft these arrows up. Boom. Alright. Let's place these down real fast. And I'm actually going to put this this storage away, or gateway away. Just gonna get as close as possible. Build around this rock. I just thought about. Have this gate, I can store the wood. Everything on the dinosaur that's right there. Try and do this. Alright, Trike, you're going to hold everything. 
I'm going to take this, 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 this. Can't craft one of those yet. Grab as much wood as I can before getting over heavy. Over heavy, I mean overweight. You guys know what I mean. Can't wait till we get stone tools too. I mean metal tools. Metal tools will be fantastic. All right, next point. Wait. Two hundred weight gonna come in handy. All right, that should be good for wood. Next is stone and thatch. All right. We're good on wood. We need some stone and some thatch. We're going to gamma down so the game doesn't look terrible. Give me all the stone. You know what I just thought about? Pick them up way easier. The multipliers on the server way easier just to pick them up. I always forget about that. I'm used to playing like a more difficult version. How much thatch do we need? 70. Done. Should be able to build it now. Ibre. Don't know. Out there. Looks good. Perfect. Alright. Drag down wood walls. It's gonna be a longer episode, guys. Enjoy. You know. Just enjoy. Uh... Ark. Don't do this to me, please. Yeah. <sighs> Invalid placement. That's going to bug me. I'll figure something out. In the future. Doesn't take much work to kind of figure out a way around that. Should be able to get my strike saddle, though, in a second. long as we keep crafting these walls up. Yep. There we go. Health. Strike. Strike saddle learned. 140 hide. And wood. Alright, so let's get the hide real fast. I want to get the saddle on it before the end of today's episode. I feel like that would be a good idea. And believe it or not... We have quite a bit of arrows to kill a par parasaur. Please don't go in the hell water. Always sounds like someone's behind me. Alright, keep an eye out for a whole lot of awful. Not much out here. Probably should cook up this meat too. Alright, stamina is still good. Oxygen is good. We still need just a tad bit more fiber. I mean, not fiber, hide. Hidey hide. 68 out of 140. How much do we have on the trike? One oh six. All right, so we need to kill something small, like a dodo. Nope, not fucking with turkeys. Turkeys are a whole lot of awfulness, demons. Swimming to the other side of this didn't work out last time. Now 
No, shut up, Sharky. Not gonna kill you. I can cross right there if need be. But here's our kill. Poor Dodo. That wasn't enough hide, was it? I don't think so. I will come back to this. I'm going to kill the turtle. I'm going to kill the turtle. If I need it, I will kill the turtle. Also cook up the meat if I can. Strike saddle. No, it was not enough. Not enough, even close. How much wood do you need? 25? Perfect. Alright, you need to grow up. I need you for harvesting berries. Just a higher end shrike, basically. There, that'll cook up. Ooh, I could actually swim to the other side of this one. No, I, do, I didn't want to do that. All right, into the water. I'm swimming. I'm swimming. Poor little muscle dog. I need your hide. I would passively tame you, but you can be a pain to tame as well. Very useful, though. I'll tell you. Why you no die. Speed of the chase. You just attack. You're not supposed to attack. Jesus. Jeebus. Now give me a good amount of hide. Okay. Acceptable amounts to hide. Um, one, two, three. Not bad at all. Movement speed. Thank you for the level, Mr. Uh, Muscle Dog. Uh, you were supposed to die as well. Oh my god, a level 194 Toto is dead. Alright, I'm going to head across this water, build my trike saddle, show you guys some berry production, do a couple arrows, and then next episode we're going to go on a taming adventure. We're going to tame whatever the hell we can. Uh, should be a good idea. Should be a very good idea. Indeed. Should get us a level or two, too, out of this. You need health. Holy crap. You are excited about getting leveled. I love the new little emotes they gave these guys. Right, you're not going to hold the what's left over in my hide, I'm sorry. Can't trust that. Health. Alright, let's see what you can do with berries. Oh, I'm loving the berry production. Loving it. Oh yeah, I'll be able to passive tame a lot of things too. 13 arrows just like that. Oh man. You're gonna be good. Alright, transfer those. I put too much weight on you. 
No, not too much weight. Oh my god, this new emote thing is amazing. I like it and then I hate it. Get a bunch of narco knockout arrows. So if you guys know what I should be taming at my level, let me know in the comments. Because I'm, I'm a noob at this. You know, you guys are more experienced at this mod than I am. Oh, there's someone built right there. I didn't even notice. Well, let me know in the comments what I should be taming at this level. Ex exceptional noob at this. I do know that I can eat tons of berries, though. Feed myself. Alright, if you guys enjoyed this episode, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out that link in the description that I was talking about to rent your own ARC server. And check out my server. Anybody's free to join for a month or even longer. We're still deciding on what we want to do. But until next time, guys, I've been Demo. Have a wonderful day.